Hello everybody, it's time for another Apex Comics video, and I have a package from ba -ba -ba, Roanoke Park, California, yes, an eBay seller there, we'll see how this goes, let's go ahead and rip it, oh criminy, tape again. Good God. Put your name into it, boy. <laughs> yeah, we got some more. <sighs> Rip it. Rip it good. Da 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 Copyright strike, no way. Ah. <laughs> <sighs> My channel is so small, they don't even recognize my channel. So, there. You strike me all they want. I'm not making any money off this anyway. I want to. Someone give me your... Give me a... Give me a method how. How can I make money on YouTube? Without having a, a thousand subscribers. Here we go. Yes, this is one more. Silver Surfer. Number six. The original... First printing. So we'll see what condition this is here. I'd like to thank the guy from eBay, uh, Harvey Doss. Thank you, Harvey. You packed it well, my friend. So, Silver Surfer. This is actually the very the backstory. I was a watcher story in this. That's uh. The first Frank Brunner art in Marvel. That's why I got it. Let's go look at this baby, shall we? Uh, yeah, Worlds Without End. It looks like a, a story by a giant conqueror from a certain galaxy. Ooh, yeah. beautiful work, John Buscema. I love this. Stanley, John Buscema, Artie Simic lettering. Of course, Sal Buscema did the inking. Great stuff, man. I love it. It's so expressive, man. I love how Busima draws Silver Surfer. Ugh, it's just, it's wonderful. Wow. I hope there's some Silver Surfer fans and, you know, my subscribers and people who happen to come across this video. So, just enjoy it, man. I love it. I think it's supposed to be. Um, that's Shalabelle professing her love to her man Norn Rad, aka Silver Surfer. Oh, something is approaching. It passed out. What? It passed it. Oh. <laughs> oh. Okay. Wow. That's Surfer going around the world. He's. Trying to break through Galactus Barrier. Somehow, he's failed. So, gets back on his board. Goes to a foreign country on Earth here. Oh, the Zen Law. Surfers from home. Oh. Well, it didn't seem to be his world. <laughs> Everything looks weird, damn. Wow. I freaking love it. All these different creatures. Like the caveman. Uh, cavemen. Oh, wow. Oh, we got ads. Huh? Whoa. They're brutish. Wow. Oh. 
They're like double size issues. This has got a lot of pages. I mean, I think you had like maybe 68 pages for like a 25 cents. That's crazy. I think it's at least 68. I remember a lot of the giant size Marvel comics that are about 68 pages. God, I love going to the convenience store way back when and buying those giant size comics. Giant size. Well, I had a giant size X-Men number two. I don't know what the heck happened to it. But I had giant size uh, Avengers, giant size Thor, giant size Captain America, giant size Iron Man, giant size Hulks, you name it, etc., etc. Giant size Fantastic Fours. Boom. Just all, almost all across the line. Giant size Spider-Man. Uh, giant size creatures. But damn, this guy looks crazy. He's got like an oversized monarch. He's from a different galaxy. He brought the Silver Surfer in. So. He's there. He's from another world. He's a ravager of worlds, it appears. He's a conqueror, a natural born conqueror. Wow. So they're all feeding him the big chicken and freaking grabbing his wine out. <laughs> Damn. He's stretching a bone to the the poor humans there. Dang. Bring on the dancers. Oh. Ah. There's one resembling Shalabal. He sweeps her away. This guy doesn't like it. Nope, the girl's hurt. Nope. You pissed off the surfer. Not a good idea. God, this guy's like, what, 100 feet tall or more? Jesus. Yeah, it keeps growing. <laughs> Love that foreshortening. I love the John Buscema work. It's one of his best works, I think. Well, since Conan and other titles that he's done. Like, wow. I think they're trying to find ways to... Uh, to uh, do away with this evil giant conqueror. He's hurt, killed people. It's like enough is enough. What a total bully, total savage, frigate. Enough is enough. He's overlord of the universe. Yeah. God, just, just the stature and the different positions of the surfer is so freaking great. See him flying fast on that board. There it shall finally end. So, may it so he was never born. Wow. Okay, let's get to the... Uh, here we go, it's some Frank Brunner. Oh wait, ooh. oh here we go. Tales of the Watcher. Ah. Bring it in. Kind of unlikely waste. 
invade Earth without anyone suspecting it. Consider carefully before you answer, and then read on. The unsuspecting. We got Stanley, Sid Shores, embellishment, which is inking by Frank Brunner. Inking Sherry Gale. That sounds like a made up name. I never heard of a Sherry Gale. It's a pseudonym. It has to be. So Sid Shores, man, he's been a World War, well, a Golden Age um, comic artist. Gosh, ever since the 40s. And he's done a lot of good penciling. I remember him on his run on Red Wolf in the early 70s. He draws so well. And then the ink work, Frank Brunner, his first ink work at Marvel. Great job, Frank. Mm -hmm. Wow. This is really cool. It's like a, a race of watchers. They can't be seen unless they want to be seen. Uh. Pants legs, man. It's a challenge to draw. You kind of find a, the best way to do it. Sometimes you screw up and it looks like... This isn't the best pants legs rendering I've seen, but... Man, they're hard. I'm trying doing it. I get it, man. This isn't bad. It's really good work. Scantily clad, big headed people. Uh. Uh -huh. But all will think of it as fiction. As much as I'm reading it right now. Ah. Uh. Wow, that's an old ass TV set. <laughs> I gotta see what. Wow. Uh, is there anything in the back? Anything in the back? I'm getting my power shakes. Yes. Yeah, I make money, get prizes. Anyway, great book Sky Riders of Spaceway Silver Surfer, number six. Please like, subscribe, and ring bell for notifications. It's your friend, Apex Comics. Have a great day.